really do want to try to start making vlogs. I just don't remember. But the goal will be to do a weekly one again if I can remember to film. Right now I'm getting ready to um, whoop, do a virtual happy hour with my friend. She sent me this peach honeysuckle wine spritzer, so I'm gonna try that out. Um, and a classy snack to go with it. I'm gonna show you how I, I do my masks. I've got cloth mask. Um, I take a paper clip so that I can connect it around the back of my head because 99% of the masks that they make are way too huge for me. I cut up a coffee filter and put it in the pocket for some extra protect. Boom. Then I take a disposable surgical mask, throw this guy on my face, Oh my god, my dryer is so loud, I'm sorry. Make sure I get that nice and snug across the top of my face there. Then I take the cloth mask and get it connected behind my head, pull it up over my ears, <laughs> which with the glasses and the hat, it's not really going so well, right? <laughs> oh lord. Uh, but then I, <laughs> I cover that up. Oh god. Normally I will adjust my hair first, and I didn't this time. <laughs> Look, I may have to start this shit over. <laughs> Cause my hair's gone wacky. Okay. <laughs> All right, we got my hair, the mask is good, throw the glasses on, make sure they sit above the mask. It kind of creates a seal so that whenever you're outside and you got the, you know, the fog on your glasses, it kind of helps make sure it doesn't fog up. Back on my head and I'm ready to go shopping. All right, Leopold, I'm going to start going and getting your tank upgrades. How exciting. All righty. I'm here and I'm going to try to get in and out as quickly as possible because I don't typically, typically even leave my house. So if I've seen one person not wearing a mask, that should don't fly with me. going with this white brown tile. I think it'll be pretty. I got home and I napped. I just woke up. And now I'm going to make some more dirt for Leopold's new tank. Um, I didn't end up buying it yet. I'm gonna go out later with a friend and get the tank, um, cause there was no way in hell I'd be able to carry it <laughs> up to the apartment alone. So, um, I'm gonna make the dirt. I'm gonna bring the tile up here from my car. I might look for some 3D backgrounds online. I can't even tell you how much I enjoy having a leopard gecko and um, it's just become my, my favorite hobby here. Okay, so I took Brick of Eco Earth and added water and I'll kind of mix it up. It should expand and dry out. And then in a couple days, I'll add it into the tank. I might end up having quite a bit left over. I'm not sure if I do. I'll just put it in a bag for, for later. 
but I decided to just make the whole thing because I was struggling to cut the brick in half. So they're saying that because of these new strains, they're kind of expecting it to be between one and three years before the virus is under control because the vaccine's not as effective on all of the new mutations. So that's depressing. Uh, I think I'm going to buy a bike this spring and get out of my apartment. Um, because I can't do one to three years cooped up like this. <gasps> Leopold is over there saying, Kendall, you're not alone. I'm here. He's actually, um, sleeping. I have about 75 crickets. He better be hungry because I don't want him to die before he can eat them. I'm trying to start my own mealworm farm, but I don't know. We'll see how it goes. So far, I just have worms. Eventually, they will pupate and then turn into beetles. And then those beetles will lay eggs. And those eggs will hatch and become little mealworms. And the cycle continues. And then I think my dirt is finally dry. So I may go through and throw that in there tonight. I am very excited. It took days. This is a good shot here. Hello. What if I did all of my vlogs just like this? Thank <laughs> you.